you might think that it's a really good idea to do more research on whether vaccines cause autism. Like, why would we not want more research? So many researchers and scientists and medical professionals and speech language pathologists like myself are so frustrated because the folks who are in charge of this expedition to look for information about whether vaccines cause autism, they don't. They're spending money on something that's already been disproven. When you hear the conclusions of this project, those conclusions will be presented by people who already have decided what they're gonna find. They have already told us who they are, they've already told us what they believe, and they have a well-documented history of bias, sharing bad information, saying that vaccines are harmful. Good research is done by folks who are free of bias. They have a perspective, and it's likely that information will be presented in such a way to confirm what they want it to say. They are not all of a sudden gonna be convinced that vaccines are great. And the danger is that folks who read the headlines who aren't thinking about how research is done or who did it are just gonna kind of take it for face value. We all have to become savvy consumers of information, especially when it impacts our health and the health of our children.